I'm Bill Britton, the Hamlin County Mayor, and today we're at Food City at Jaybird Road and talking about a partnership between Food City and Farm Bureau and how it benefits uh, uh, nonprofit agencies in, in Hamlin County. This is David Morlock, the manager of the store. David, what about the role of Food City? Uh, we're, we're happy to uh, be involved with the Farm Bureau ladies and give them this opportunity to bring her. Uh, four charities in and shop here today and uh, we give a little bit too and we appreciate it. Thank you. What about Farm Bureau? What's your role in this? Appreciate that. I'm Stephen Huff, uh, Upper East Tennessee Regional Farm Bureau Field Director. Uh, what we've got going on today is the Farm Bureau Women's in Hamblin County are here shopping to provide four organizations within Hamblin County uh, food that they may not otherwise have for the folks uh, within the county that really need it. And the Tennessee Farm Bureau Federation partners with uh, Tennessee Agriculture and other organizations across the state to feed the hungry uh, in the state of Tennessee. And, and believe it or not, there are folks out there uh, that may be your neighbor that, that might not have lunch today uh, or breakfast tomorrow. And so the Farm Bureau women in Hamlin County and other Farm Bureau women across the state are, are taking part in this action to help uh, prevent some of that hunger that's going on right in our neighborhood. Guys, thanks for uh, partnering with each other and, and to benefit our community. What makes Morristown and Hamlet County great are companies like Farm Bureau and Food City and the agencies that they serve. I'm Lynette with the Pregnancy Crisis Center and uh, I want to talk about today's event and how important it is to what we do in this community. We're not allowed to buy a formula because we try to allocate our money in other ways that, of things that are not provided elsewise. So since we have the WIC program, our board has voted not to purchase it. So we totally depend on people to donate. And so everything we get today will be formula for moms and babies in this area that are in need and they can come to our center and and get a can of formula within their first year. Hi, I'm Tina with Senior Citizens Home Assistance Service. I started a food pantry about three years ago. I thought that there were a lot of people in Hamlin County uh, going hungry, a lot of the elderly folks. So we opened this food pantry and we've had two calls since we've been here in the store this morning of uh, folks needing food. It, this is a very valuable program. Uh, they're able to have food at the end of each month that they normally would not have and uh, we're just we just thank God every day for this I mean it's God's hands been on it ever since I opened it up and it's just been wonderful my name is Lindsay Sora and I'm with Matt's we are a self-sufficiency program for homeless men women and children in Hamlin County and nine surrounding counties um, this shopping trip is so important for us because while we receive a weekly food truck, it doesn't always contain things like meats and dairy products. And so this allows us to come in and stock up on some of those items so that we can better serve our residents. Thank you, Farm Bureau Women. My name is Megan McLaughlin and I'm from Alps Adult Day Services. Um, we are an adult day service that um, services clients over the age of 18 that have a physical or cognitive disability. Um, so with this donation, we are able to serve um, currently 60 clients, um, breakfast, lunch, and an afternoon snack. Hello, my name's Samuel. I'm from Morristown East FFA with uh, Phila Fort. And I'm Brandon, I'm also from East High FFA, and so we're partnered with FFA and Farm Bureau to do the fill of Ford. So what that is is a food drive for our actual pantry at East High, and then we're also going to distribute the food on foot and the daily bread here in Morristown. 